were not out. I mean, they go to court to get punished. I mean, they go to, to prisons to become better neighbors. I want to work in a system where, um, where we can give people second chances. Mm -hmm. Not everybody wants it or, you know, uses that second chance, maybe the third or fourth. But um, I want to be able to provide them with the tools that they need to uh, become a better person, better citizen, better dad, better neighbor, and better Mm -hmm. employee when they get out and we don't do that by locking them into a cell and punish them mm -hmm. like animals but when that door closes at the end of the night it doesn't matter if you have tiles on the floor or if you have a flat screen tv on the wall it doesn't really matter mm -hmm. the door is locked i met a very young kid once he was uh 18 and uh, uh he was 11 when his mother started providing him with heroin uh, so he had no chance in life like from the beginning. He was so helpless and we all, he knew he didn't have a chance and I knew he didn't have a chance. We did everything we could. But at the end of the day, when, you, when, I, when we released him, I walked into the gate, I knew it wasn't gonna work out. And we, I've spent, I spent a lot of time with him. Um, but I knew it wasn't gonna work. And it took three weeks and then he died from an overdose. And I, I yeah. Uh, and this is, um, I don't know, it was many years ago, but I still, I still can't talk about it without, you know, almost crying because mm. I, I wish I mean I was young I think I did everything I could I think we as a prison did everything I could uh, but you know you always wonder if you could have done more I probably couldn't yeah. but you know there's always that thank you so much <laughs> <laughs> this is wonderful it really yeah. is I hope you're proud you should be I am <laughs> not satisfied but proud okay. yeah. <laughs> that's a good saying <laughs> it is a good saying I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm sorry. Sorry. I'm sorry.